Hello and welcome back to our channel. The channel is called Ute Circle Witch Corner. Um, thank you that you're all joining me today when we are talking about our migraine tincture. So the migraine tincture is made out of uh, fever fuel and the German word is Mutterkraut and also meadowsweet. So it's a combination between feverfew and meadowsweet. The German word for meadowsweet is Mädesüß. <laughs> that sounds strange, but do you know the German words for feverfew and meadowsweet? So from our experience, we had last year in um, one of our shows, uh, yes, again, a customer and she came around to our booth and she said, Oh my God, oh my God, I have such a migraine coming up. And do you have anything? I was said, yes, we have our migraine tincture. Um, we also have capsules, but for, I always say, tinctures are for emergency, for immediately help here, take our migraine tincture. And she bought the migraine tincture, she opened it on the booth, and she took two droppers, um, under her tongue and she went away and she came back two hours later just to say oh my lord it was helping more or less immediately I cannot even thank you it was such amazing and these are reaction for us showing us what we are making with our alternative medicine is helping you so but now to the details from our migraine tincture so as I said, it's feverfew and meadowsweet. So feverfew, the plant is primarily used to prevent migraine-like headache and treat inflammation. Researchers thought a substance called, now I have a special word again, <laughs> parthenolide, which helps relieve spasm and smooth muscles tissue, what was what made feverfew effective against migraines. Easy, helping with nausea, and vomiting um, when you really have a hard hard migraine this is something it's coming automatically um, that you are nausea and sometimes you even vomiting I call myself lucky and can as well we do not have any migraines ever and we have hardly any headache maybe because we are just using our own alternative medicine it could be <laughs> so <clears throat> the second part in our Tincture is meadowsweet and meadowsweet is an absolute anti-headache herb. It's like willow bark. You remember willow bark? There is a video out as well. Willow bark, it contains salicyl acid and it's known as a painkiller. And this um, salicyl, <laughs> let me do it again. Salicylic, salicylic, oh my hair. Salicylic is um, a painkiller known as ASA. And you will find this salicylic in aspirin, for example. So now, as I said with a customer who came last year or the year before in one of our shows, um, imagine a natural solution that could provide fast relief from those pounding headaches. Introduction, the migraine tincture made from feverfew and meadowsweet will help you kind of immediately. I mean, it's not like you take it under your tongue and yay, my migraine is gone. No, <laughs> you need to give the herb a little bit of time. Um, the tincture, I would say half an hour, latest an hour, as the customer told us, and you feel the relief from this terrifying migraine. Traditional, and this is um, what I learned, traditional migraine medications often comes with uh, limitations and side effects. Hmm? We know all the side effects. When you go to the doctor, you get a medication prescription and then you have so many side effects and you need another pill for helping you with the side effects. So the side effects for traditional migraine medication is, for example, um, stomach pain, dizziness, fainting, vomiting, black bloody stool. And this is making it a challenge um, for effective relief when you have all the side effects with our tincture our migraine tincture with meadowsweet and feverfew there are no side effects seriously there are no side effects the only effect you have you're free of your migraine okay so that's where i always say the natural alternative uh, medicine is helping you on an easier way without all the side effects 
worldwide and this is amazing and as i said ken and i we don't have any migraine i don't even know if anybody from our family is ever having a migraine attack um, but worldwide one billion individuals suffering from migraines several times per week per average one bis uh, one bis this is a german word one to two times per month can you imagine you're laying down you are more or less out of order you cannot work because you have this terrible migraine and this terrible headache and maybe yeah even with nausea and vomiting um it can be up to four hours or even three days that you have such a migraine uh, episode, I want to say. Um, migraine can be triggered by lack of sleep, um, weather change, which is at the moment permanently, it's cold, it's warm, it's cold, it's warm. Um, if you are hungry and you don't eat, excessive sensory stimulation, stress or other factors. They can be um, by physical activity, uh, can trigger a migraine like light, sounds or smells. So there are different things that can uh, trigger a migraine if you have this issue and you have episodes up to three times um, per month or even more. So in conclusion, what I want to say, the migraine, our, my <laughs> migraine tincture made from Feverview and Meadowsweet is a game changer for anyone seeking fast and effective relief from migraine symptoms. Its natural ingredients offer the gentle yet powerful solution for do, uh, those in need. So may you think about it, um, trying the alternative to the doctor um, medication or prescription or even over the counter when you read the side effects drips, and you said oh no <laughs> I just want to get rid of my migraine I don't want to feel sick because of the side effects as we talked about earlier so yeah migraine our tincture is called migraine um, from Feverview and Meadowsweet it's non-alcohol I made it with glycerine so even a teenager can take it without any alcohol in it. So glycerine is, and it makes a little bit of sweet, so it's easier to take. Okay, so let's see, micro. I just want to find, <laughs> I don't have all the dosage in my head. So take two to three dropper up to three times per day from our tincture. But as I said, it is an emergency and you feel, I can just um, repeat what the, the customer is telling me. Um, you feel it when a migraine is coming. I don't know because as I said, I never ever, knock on wood, had a migraine. So you can feel it that the migraine is coming. And at this point, you take the migraine tincture, two droppers under your tongue, and it's not coming through. You feel the relief or even if you already have the symptoms from a migraine, it, it's already there. Take one of our tinctures, uh, migraine tinctures, and you feel the relief more or less immediately. Okay. But as always, friends, I am not a doctor. I'm your master herbalist and I will not and I cannot give you any medical advice. If you need to talk to or you need a medical advice, please go ahead and call to your uh, call or visit your doctor and ask him for any advices. But if you trust us as a herbalist and you have the experience already with herbal alternative medicine, you're more than welcome. Talk to us, shoot us a message, give us a call, visit our beautiful store. Okay. And you should not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel because here you have a big, big, um, palette of different herbs we are explaining how you use them how you make them how you make creams how you make tinctures it's a very interesting youtube channel we have and of course it's called Uda Silver Ridge Corner okay so I would say oh and maybe I want to show you sorry how I take the, the little camera so this here is Fever View and this here is Meadowsweet um, just a side note our ones in the last video, we said we are redoing our plant. So for every two years in our yard on our little homestead here, and they are not grown yet. So Feverview and Meadowsweet and Ashwagandha and all the herbs we have, they are just a little bit out, but not enough to show you the plant. But if you see Feverview, you would say, hey, it looks like chamomile. Mm -hmm, that's right. Chamomile and Feverview. Feverview, the flowers are a little bit smaller than chamomile, uh, chamomile. 
<laughs> me and my pronunciation again. It's a little bit smaller, the, the flower, but that's why people sometimes say to fever few, it's wild chamomile. Mm -mm, it's fever few. <laughs> okay. So I hope you enjoy this video. And yeah, I see you the next video next weekend. Hope you see you all. Stay healthy. Bye bye. Love and light. Ciao, ciao. Your Ute from Ute Sorbel Rich Corner. Stay healthy. Bye. Ciao, ciao.